checkup day. Excuse me. Don't forget, today is the last day for all regular checkups. Please line up. What are you doing, Cap? There's a line here, you know. You have to go all the way to the back. Yeah, yeah Cap, Cap, we've, we've been, been waiting, waiting a long, a long time. time. I made a reservation. You could have done that, too. Really? We can do that? Of course you can. That's how I'm first in line. Oh, gee, I really wish I'd made a reservation like Cap. If you did, you wouldn't have to get here first thing in the morning. See you later. All right, then. Come on, you guys. I think we can make reservations right there. Let's do it, then. <clears throat> Excuse me, we'd like to make a reservation. Uh-huh. Try the big button. Okay. Mm. Your number is 300. 300? 24. Please tell me this doesn't mean that there are 323 reservations in front of us. I guess we needed hmm. to do this ahead of time. I wish someone told us. Oh, well. I guess we have to get back in line. Uh, uh, back uh, of the line. Uh, oh. hmm. Looking good, Scooby. Can you read the first line, please? It's a dipstick. No, a gas tank. Oh, I'm so nervous. And now the horn. You ready to go, Cap? I'm ready. We have to check how well your brakes would work in a rainstorm. Go as fast as you can, then stop when that light over there turns red, okay? No problem. <laughs> Good work, Cap. Nothing wrong with those brakes. That's because I go for my maintenance huh. check every six months. I wish that Spooky could be as responsible as you are. It's been three years since he had a checkup. <sighs> what? That's way too long. Today is the last day for all regular checkups. Please report to headquarters if you still need one. <laughs> oh? Guess I better go. <laughs> Spooky, make sure they check out your exhaust system. We can hardly breathe back here. Uh, it takes three years of oh. hard work to make smoke this dirty. I set a record. Oh, Spooky, why won't you grow up? Spooky, slow down. Hi, Cap. <laughs> <laughs> I'm scared you, didn't I? Look, here's my magic wand. That's not a magic wand. It's just an old broken headlight. It's not broken. It's super fun. You're going to have an accident one of these days. Don't you worry. Something like that won't happen to me. Spooky, why oh? won't you go and get your regular mm. checkup? Nah, I'm really busy huh? right now. Maybe next year. Next year, you'll just put it off again. Well, there's no way I can go now. Why? Posty's battery is completely dead. Huh? I need to give him a lift to the battery charging station. Spooky, huh? you should worry about yourself. That's fine. Huh? I know my body the best. Uh. Take care. <coughs> Spooky! The volume of your horn can't go over the red signal, or you'll be disqualified. Okay, we're ready when you are. Uh, uh, uh. Sorry, Dump. Those who are disqualified should get repaired right away. Then you'll need another checkup. Yeah, all, right. all right. Great, then you're all dismissed. Uh. There were a lot of disqualifications this year. It could be because we had the best attendance at regular checkup this year that we've ever had in Broomstown. Everybody but Spooky. He missed it again? I waited for him all day, but he never showed up at all. Do you think we should go out and look for him? Hmm. hmm. Yes, maybe we should. Wait, I'll go find him. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Spooky? He isn't back yet? Is something wrong? He never came for his regular checkup. What? I told him it was today. <laughs> <laughs> Yahoo! <laughs> hey, wait up! Come back and let's play! <laughs> 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 
Huh? I was hoping we could play a game. Huh? What happened? <coughs> oh, hey, <laughs> Spooky, huh? what took you so long? You're two hours, ten minutes, thirteen seconds late. Sorry. <laughs> Posty, I just learned how to make white steam come out of my nostrils. I don't have time huh? for this nonsense. Hmm. I have all these deliveries to make. Yeah, but did you see that steam? It was awesome. Huh? <sighs> Uh-oh. I can't do it no. now. It was working just a minute ago. Spooky, I can play with you when I'm all done working. But I'm busy now, and I have to get to the charging station. <laughs> no problem. Huh? huh? Spooky, your nose is bright red, like Rudolph the reindeer. <laughs> Whoa, hot, hot, hot. Whoa, make it stop. Make it stop. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> What? Where's the fire? No! Oh, no! The packages! We can't let them get destroyed! What do I do? Oh. It's all my fault. I'm so sorry. Hmm. Hallie, do you want to read a book while you're waiting? No, thanks. I'm okay. He should have been back by now. <sighs> See you next time, Cap. Have a good evening, sir. <sighs> There's a fire at the post office! What should I do? What should I do? Do something or the whole place will burn down! Has this not been a good day? Uh, hey, Posty! Uh, I think I should go find some water! Oh, Posty! I can't seem to go anywhere! Uh, spooky! Cap! What's going on here? Well, it's kind of a long story. Cap, do you think you could help us? We're not sure what to do. What do you think you should do? We need to call the rescue squad. You've reached the rescue squad. Jin, you'll never believe what Spooky's done. Go on and tell me, Cap. The post office is on fire. What? Rescue team, we have a fire. What? what? There's a fire? The post office is on fire. All, All right. right. Checkup today. This never would have happened. I hope that the rescue squad's on its way. Uh -huh. They're here. Don't worry, we're here to help. Roy? Yup. Stand back! Amber, please make sure our friends are safe. <laughs> Helly, get the mail. I'm on it! <laughs> I need help! The wind picked up! We need backup here! I'll get the fire extinguisher! All right. Great job, everyone. Wow, that was a close one. Oh, thanks, guys. <laughs> This is just a little jump. Mm -hmm. It'll be enough to get you to the charging station. 
Spooky, uh -huh. you should really go and get your regular <laughs> checkup now. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, Amber. Amber. But how am I going to make all of my deliveries? Even if I get recharged, there's no way I can deliver all of them today. I'm so sorry, Posty. Oh, it's fine. Mm. Don't mm. worry, Posty. Huh? We can help. Huh? If we all pitch in, we'll have it done in no time. Everybody ready? We're, We're ready. ready. No one knows Broomstown better than me. Let me come. <laughs> I'd like to help. You need to have your regular checkup first. That's, That's right. right. <laughs> Thanks, Spooky. I appreciate you wanting to help, but you really need to get your checkup. I think I'd prefer a healthy Spooky. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> spooky, I hope you'll keep up with your checkups from now on. <laughs> yeah, I'll never put off till tomorrow what I can do today. Mm -hmm. Rescue Squad, are we all ready to do some work? Time to deliver the mail, everyone. Let's do it. All right. Huh? <laughs> 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 Fuss about ghost. Coming. I'm in. You coming? Uh, it looks like I am. All right. Let's meet on Banana Street later today. We'll swear. Yeah, we'll swear. We'll swear. <laughs> Are you hurt? Huh? Oh. Huh? I'm all right. Oh. I have some really big news. What's, What's up? up? Oh. Cap told me. He said last night... This isn't oh. about the ghost, is it? What? How did you know? Cap was telling the same story last year. Yep. He tells us that story every year around this time. Don't you remember <laughs> ghost hunting with him all through the forest? This time it sounded real. Helly, that story gets better each time he tells it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I thought I had some really big news to share. Helly, do you want to hear some news that I have? <laughs> All right. Your rear propeller is broken huh? again. Hmm. Huh? Brody! Brody! Welcome! Well, are you two ready? Uh, we're really going out there? Sure we are. You must be really scared, huh? Uh, I'm all right. Great, then we'll follow you. It's the only way to show you're not a chicken. Rhody, you're being kind of a bully. I'll be all right. I, I can take the lead, but you guys have to promise me that we'll all stay together. Promise! Oh. Jin, huh? I think we should check it out. He seems so sincere this time. Can you try and give it a spin? That's right. I'm the best at things like this. So, will you come? You'll have to solve this one yourself. Oh. Hmm. Jin! But please tell the ghost I said hello. Jin! Oh. On the bravest car in Broom's 
town. I'm not afraid of ghosts. I'm the brave. Ah! Do you think that was a ghost? It was just a piece of paper, you chicken. Rody, I think we should go back. There are no ghosts here. Another chicken. You two go back under your blankies. Oh. I'll go on myself. Oh, yeah? Do you think we should let him go by himself? That's up to him. I would love to see him learn his lesson. Ah! <gasps> Wasn't that Rody? 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 Where, Where are you? you? Oh. I'm in here. Oh. <laughs> what happened oh. out there? Oh. Stop laughing at me. I just saw a scary ghost. Oh, a ghost? Where? <laughs> There's nothing out here. Are you sure you saw something? Uh, but he was out there just a minute ago. So you tried to hide and got stuck uh, in there? <laughs> uh, um, I love it. <sighs> Come on, you have to try and get me out. I'm completely stuck inside. Hold tight. Uh, Benny and I will go and see if we can find uh, someone uh, to help. Yeah. You ready? Let's go. Wait! Uh, huh? I'll be too scared here out by myself. What should uh, we do? I'll go for help by myself. All alone? Rody will get eaten by the ghost if he stays here all by himself. But what if the ghost tries to eat you? Don't worry. I'll just outrun him. <laughs> don't be scared. Just look straight ahead. And don't think about ghosts. Think about finding help. Oh! Oh! Oh, oh, now I think I'm lost. Who's going to go find help for me? I am a chicken. Huh? That looks like Ellie. Help! Help uh -huh. me! Down here! Huh? It's me! Benny? <sighs> Benny! Uh, 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 here! Are you okay? Mm, I'm okay, but Rody needs your help. Rody's in danger? Why isn't Benny uh -huh. back yet? Do you think uh -huh. he went home and just left us out here? Uh, no, no way. No! <gasps> oh! Rody! Huh? Minnie! <laughs> it's Kelly and Benny! Are you oh. alright? What happened, mm. Rody? Can you please get me out of here? Don't worry, you'll be out in no time. <laughs> I may need a little more assistance here. Jin! No! Ah! I was just about finished here. Sorry, Jin, but uh, do you know where Heli went? He's not back? He's still in the haunted forest. Haunted, haunted forest? forest? Correct. Huh? It's, it's him. him. Helly, did you give the ghost my message? Not yet, but we have a little problem. What's wrong? I'll upload the video. The, the little, little trio. trio. What are they doing out there? I think they were looking for the ghost when Rody got stuck in the hollow log. He's in there good. We need some extra muscle to get him out. Can you guys help? Of course, Heli. Rescue, Rescue squad, squad away! away. We're almost at the edge of the forest, so let us know where you are. Okay. <sighs> Over there, let's hurry up. <clears throat> Will they get him out? Don't worry, we'll get him. Uh, they're here! Hmm. Huh. 
Are you kids all right? I secured the area. Everyone's fine, <laughs> except Rody. Huh. Wow, that is a tight fit. Rody, we'll get you free. You ready? Mm -hmm. <laughs> the ghost is back! Oh, help me! Rody! <laughs> Are you all right? Yeah, I'm okay. That's good. Let's get you free. Okay. Whoa! I'm alive! <laughs> you were really lucky. Now you know that coming to the forest alone at night can be dangerous. He's right. Everything looks different when it's dark out, and it's easy to get lost. Plus, you could run into a wild animal. Now we know. This whole thing was my fault. I called Benny a chicken and made him come. A chicken? Do you have any idea how brave he was? <laughs> Sorry, Benny. I'll never call you a chicken as long as I live. It's all right. <laughs> <laughs> Your hungry ghost was just a screech owl. So does that mean we're safe? Right. And now that you know there's no ghost, we can all get some sleep. Yay! I can lead the way out. <laughs> Since everybody knows how brave I am. A ghost! Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Try not to hurry. Hello. Good morning. Good morning. Uh -huh. <laughs> Did you, Did hear, you that? hear that? Out of the way, everyone. I'm really late. Look out. Scooby! Coming through! Uh, uh, slow down! Sorry! Uh, I've never been this late in my entire life! Oh no! No, oh, this will make me really late! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Oh, it's nice to see you again. Sorry about what happened back there. I'm usually right on time. But my alarm never went off this morning, and now if this light doesn't change, the kids will be late for school. Oh, great. Pardon me, but I have to keep moving. Oh. Really? Doesn't this thing know I have to get through? Hmm? Uh, I can't waste any more time. I'm desperate. Oh, I can take the east gate. Hmm? Oh. Good job, Helly. Helly. <laughs> Did we do all right? I was worried about the farm's flooding, but they were all fine. There were a couple of big puddles downtown, but they're almost gone. Everything was dry on the edge of town. I checked on the roads near Wind Hill and along the coast. There was some serious damage to the hill, and there was actually a landslide on Coast Road. All right. I guess we should start on the repairs then. And set up some roadblocks to keep drivers safe. All those things need to be done. Hmm, but we have a bigger problem. We, we do? do? My weather forecast was completely wrong. I was sure it wasn't supposed to rain yesterday. Huh? That's all? That's not all. Today, I predicted thunderstorms, but it's warm and dry. Don't be so upset. You couldn't possibly predict the weather correctly every single day. And you can't predict an accident. That's why we're here. 
Come on, cheer up. I guess you're right. Oh, you have got to be kidding. Dumpy, huh? what's going on here? I need to get through. As you can see, the road's uh -huh. been destroyed by the rainstorm yesterday, oh. so I'll have to ask you to wait here. Oh, see, that's not going to work. I'm already running so late. How long will it take? Bruner, how long should he wait? Max, how long should he wait? Oh, how long should he wait? <laughs> Just for a while? <laughs> Just for a while. Uh, just for a while. Okay. Well, only if by just for a while you mean a short while and not a really long while because I'm so behind schedule you wouldn't believe it and eventually it might be nice if I could get the kids to school. I wish that we could help you, but nobody can use the roads until they're safe. But, oh, I'm sure all the children are at the bus stop right now wondering what's happening. Hmm? Uh, 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 aha! I'm sure no one will mind if I take that little road. Hold on there a minute, Scooby. Wrong way! That way's not... You can't... Uh, uh, what was it? I'm going to make it! Yay! Woohoo! All I have to do is go through the tunnel! Oh, oh, oh this is not good. Oh, oh, oh. What's going on? Oh no, a roadblock. It must be because of all the rain we had yesterday. I have to find a way past the tunnel. How should I do it? Oh, I know, I'll just go around it. That screaming? Uh, someone help! It sounds like someone on the coast road needs help. I just saw Scooby going down the coast road. Oh, what? No one should be down there. That road was damaged in the storm. What if Scooby got in an accident? You're right. Call the rescue team. You've reached Jen. Hi, Max. What's up? What? Scooby? I'll send the rescue team. We have an emergency. All units ready to move out. We're, We're ready. You get his location. Okay, I'm on it, Polly. I have a visual on him. It's just like Max said. He's stuck outside the number one tunnel. Tell me what you see. What's going on down there? Let me get a little closer. It looks like he was trying to turn around and backed into the guardrail. He's hanging off the edge of the cliff and he's about to fall. Get here quick! Okay, see if there's any place where you can set up the safety rope. Got it! Roy, we'll need the crane. <laughs> Amber, you and I need to pull Scooby up. No problem. Let's do it! Ellie, don't come near me or we'll both go over the edge. The ground is so soft it can give out any minute. Don't worry, Scooby. We're not going to let anything happen to you. Uh, 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 
I'm in position. I'm in position, too. I'm ready, Polly. Okay, Helly. Hook the rope on his back. Okay. <laughs> Don't worry, Scooby. You won't fall. Do you promise? Yep. Go ahead. <sighs> Keep pulling, he's moving! Roy, pull harder! All right, here goes! Scooby, we're getting you out now! Oh, hurry up! I can't take it! No, Scooby! Don't spin your wheels like that! Just trust us and let us pull you up, or we'll all fall! Uh, okay, go ahead. Roy, give it one more good one! Right! <laughs> okay, Polly, he's almost level with the ground. Great, Scooby! Now spin those wheels! Uh, carefully, uh, carefully, uh, carefully. Uh, Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> thank you, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. <laughs> All better now. All right, can I go get the kids now? Almost. But first, you really need to go get a checkup, okay? All right, <laughs> I will. Thank you, Amber. Huh? Oh. And don't hurry. <laughs> of course not. <laughs> 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 okay, kids, take your time getting to your seats. We want to be nice and safe. Yeah! Woohoo! Let's go to school! I want to be praised. Wow, that's awesome! That's wow. impressive, Bruno! Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Ta-da! Man, Bruner is amazing at juggling that ball. <laughs> Poke! Huh? Poke! <laughs> hmm? What is it, Mr. Builder? In the paper today. It's about Poke. He did something really fantastic. So what kind of fantastic thing did Poke do? Look, it's all right here. According to this article, Poke dug up a rare old tire while he was working at Mr. Musty's house. Well, Poke, huh? that's incredible. <laughs> it sure is. That tire is more than 100 years old. A 100-year-old tire? Nobody cares about that boring old junk. No, you're wrong. They think this might be a tire from the legendary police car Thunder. I heard that Wheeler's keeping it until they can donate it to the museum. Poke? Huh? It's unbelievable. Why didn't you tell us about this? Now that's a feat worth bragging about. Yeah, Poke, this is great. <laughs> oh, come on. Why are you saying no? I said no, and I mean no. Oh, just let me see it for a second. Musty. You might scratch it. I won't take that chance. Don't worry. We'll be really careful. No way. 
And that is final. It's not looking good. <laughs> you listen to me, Wheeler. We only want to see the tire. Honestly, Poke found it over at my place. That means the tire is mine. It doesn't matter where he found it. It's part of our history. Now, if you'll excuse me. Oh, you're so petty. What? I'm petty? Is that what you said? Yes, and what of it? Um, I think that we'll be going. This friendship uh... is now over. Hm. That's fine. Who needs to have a friend like you? Hm. Uh, um, uh... Wow! Poke's story made the front page. Mm-hmm. I can't believe that tire is as old as it is. Hey, guys. We have a problem. What is it, Helly? It's Mr. Musty and Mr. Wheeler. They say they're not friends. What? What, what happened? Well, um... I went with Mr. Musty to visit Mr. Wheeler. All we wanted to do was to see the old tire that Poke found. It's so sad when a mm. good friendship ends over an argument. Oh. I tried to break it up, but they were so mad. So I thought maybe the rescue team can help. Huh? What's up? You look kind of upset. Something on your mind? Kind of. Everyone's making a big deal over Poke. I wish I had found that tire. Hmm. Well, you could go and dig around Mr. Musty's yard. Who knows what other cool stuff is buried there? Huh? That's it! Why didn't I think of that? <laughs> what? You want to dig up my yard? Yep. Picture it. If I found something better than that old tire, I'd be even more famous than Poke. Come on, can't you just see the newspaper article saying that a second historic artifact was found in your yard? <laughs> and it was dug up by me? Well, let's get digging. Wheeler, this means war. What? Apologize to him? That will not happen. Yes, but try to see it from Mr. Musty's point of view for a moment. Oh, no. I won't do it. Well, that whole visit was a waste of time. Oh, oh no. no! What now, then? <sighs> Mr. Musty, I think I found something. Huh. Really? What is it? <laughs> Bruna, that's just some garbage. Yeah, you're right. I'll look some more. <laughs> Bruna, maybe we should stop for now. Just a minute. I feel like I'm on the verge of a remarkable discovery. I'd rather you stop. You would have found something by now. And look what you've done to my landscaping. Hmm. <sighs> Mr. Musty, look. Way over there by that tree. I bet there's something special there. That's it. Go home. But I'm not done. I can't believe I ever agreed to this. I want you to get off of my property. It's time to go home. <sighs> well, I guess there's just one spot left. He won't be mad if I find something awesome. All right, come on, something really good, like some jewelry or an old treasure map. Actually, I don't really care what it is. Water bottle, water bottle, soda can, juice pouch, dirty tissue. No. <sighs> There's nothing here but a bunch of junk. Just some old diapers and shopping bags. Oh. Yeah. Oh, no. How am I going to get back up? <sighs> What are you doing here? I'm trapped! Oh. Please help me! Yeah. Bruno! Hi, Mr. Musty! You have to go for help! Somebody has to help me out! Oh dear! Hold on! Stay there! I'm going to call the rescue team! Seriously? They won't apologize to each other? I think Mr. Wheeler got really angry about this. Isn't, Isn't there, there anything, anything that, that we, we can, can do? do? Maybe. Hmm. Huh? Huh? Rescue headquarters? Jim, there's trouble. Bruno was digging in the garden in front of my house and somehow got stuck in a hole. Is that so? Don't worry, Mr. Musty. We're on our way. 
Over and out. Are you okay? Holy, get me out of here! I'm scared! <laughs> Calm down, Bruner. We'll get you out of there right now. Helly, lower the safety harness down to Bruner, please. Yes, sir! Everything will be fine. We'll have you out of here in no time. Roy, are you ready? Yes, let's do this! Roy, lower the hook. You got it. We're good. Oh. Let's go. I'm so scared. Bruner, it's okay. Take it slow, Roy. Oh. Are you okay? I'm okay. I think so. Now, Amber, please fix the tree. I'm on it. Roy, can you pull him out? Here goes. <laughs> Thanks, guys. It looks like you have no injuries. Good job. <laughs> so tell us, Bruner, how did you end up down there? Well, you see, I was jealous of Polk and wanted to find something... something special. Let me get this straight. You did this just for attention? Yes. I hope you'll forgive me for this. <laughs> Musty? Uh? Wheeler! Musty, please tell me you're all right. What? Am I not supposed to be all right? I was at the shop listening to the scanner. I was afraid you were the one in trouble. Hold on, so you're worried about me now? <clears throat> <laughs> well, that's what friends do. Wow, so does this mean that you two are friends again? Uh, I, I guess, guess so. <laughs> <laughs> uh, look, oh. is that... Musty, do you remember what's inside? Yes, of course I do. That's the time capsule that you and I put together many years ago. It holds all of our precious memories. Bruner, it turns out you found something great. I found something after all? You sure did. If it wasn't for your determination, all our memories would have stayed buried forever. Bruna, we're, we're so, so grateful, grateful for that. that. Did you both just give me compliments? Oh, did we? I guess we did. Hooray! <laughs> I finally got praise! <laughs> <laughs> Trust your friends. Abracadabra stick! Ta-da! Huh? It's 
amazing, right? It was in the station when it got hit by lightning, and now it's magnetized. That's really marvelous. <sighs> you woke us up at dawn just to show us a magic trick? Not magic. It turned into a magnet. Okay, but how? Mm, well, it's a little bit hard to explain. Are you sure that you know? Of course I know. I just can't explain it right now. Huh? Rescue team, this is Jin. Jin! Uh, somebody robbed my store! Robbed your store? What? what? A, a robbery? Somebody has stolen my tires. What? Just look at the mess he made around my shop. It's absolutely outrageous. Calm down, Mr. Wheeler. Could you tell me exactly what happened when you came in this morning? Well, let's see. I arrived at the store just before dawn. I noticed someone moving in the darkness. I was a bit scared, but I approached anyway. Then the scoundrel ran away. Were you able to get a look at the culprit's face? That I'm not too sure of. And have you noticed anything or anybody strange in the past few days? Well, wait a minute. Cleany! Cleany? Hmm. I was doing my daily inventory, as usual. 19, 20, 21, 20. When suddenly, I got the feeling that I was being watched. I turned around, and there was Cleany. Huh? Hmm, what is he doing out there? Come back later. That's all? What do you mean? Don't you think that's strange? Not at all. Huh? Maybe he wanted to buy a tire. If he wanted to buy a tire, he should have said something instead of staring at me like that. I tell you, it was very strange. Queenie has huh? a hard time talking to people sometimes because mm -hmm. he's shy. That could be an act. What if he's pretending to be shy when in reality he's a master criminal? I don't think so, but I better speak with Cleany anyway. Mr. Wheeler thinks I'm a suspect? I'm innocent! I just thought his store was dirty and wanted to clean it. But I was too embarrassed to say something about it, so when he saw me, I just drove away. You don't really think that I stole anything, do you? I don't, Cleany. All I needed was for you to tell me what happened yesterday. Uh, Cleany? Uh, oh yeah, I remember something. Yesterday, when I drove away from Mr. Wheeler's store, somebody else was there. Who was uh, it? It was Posty! <laughs> Posty, why are you so surprised? It's nothing, just never mind. Oh. And then he just drove away. So, don't you think that's weird? Hmm, interesting. I guess I better go ask Posty some questions. What? You think I stole a tire? Just calm down. Well, if you must know, I was delivering a surprise gift to the shop for Mrs. Green. You said a surprise gift? <laughs> Posty. Uh, sorry. Yes, a surprise gift. Don't tell anybody about it because it's a surprise. You see, I was only doing my job. Hmm. I understand. Know what? I can't believe that Cleany would think that I stole a tire! Oh, oh, oh my! See there? The thief isn't me! Hmm. But even so, couldn't he have stolen the tires after he finished delivering the surprise? No way! Cleany! Why are you trying to give me the blame? Is it because you stole the tire? No! It wasn't me! I'm innocent! Well, it seems to me that Cleany is the criminal! No, I'm not! I swear! Uh. Huh? Stop it, everybody. Huh? It looks to me like the criminal isn't Cleany or Posty. Huh? What? Take a look at this. See how these tire tracks are stained with oil? Whoever the culprit is, he must work with oil. Work with, with oil? oil? Well, then, yes, it must be Mr. Musty. What makes you say that? A few days ago, Mr. Musty was in my store shopping for a mini tire. Also, he's an old car, so he runs on oil. <laughs> but the marks here clearly weren't made by the kind of tires that Mr. Musty has. It's Cap! Cap? I heard Cap change tires a few days ago. <laughs> Posty, 
cap isn't an oil car. Uh, but what about Spooky? My goodness, you all are accusing your friends without any evidence. But it seems like when you think about it, they're, they're all, all suspicious! suspicious. Hmm. <sighs> you just need to let me investigate. Well, what does it say, Jin? Hmm, these tire tracks just aren't enough to go on. There are over a hundred cars in Broomstown that use this kind of tire, you know. Hmm, this is getting complicated. Oh, I just can't believe it. A thief in Broomstown. Listen, there's something worse going on than the robbery itself. What is it? Everybody is so suspicious of one another. Mr. Wheeler suspects everybody who's been to his store. Posty and Cleany suspect each other. <laughs> and people are starting to say that Mr. Wheeler is suspicious. This old man says I stole his tires. I say he made it up to commit insurance fraud. No way! It's like the people of Broomstown don't trust each other anymore. Well, couldn't Mr. Wheeler have gotten his tire count wrong? Or maybe he sold the tires and forgot. No, Roy. I double-checked his inventory myself. Uh, well, now what? Then who could be the crook? Well, couldn't the answer be in the pictures I took? I took a lot of them. You certainly did. <laughs> Helly, did you only take pictures and not investigate? What? I was gathering all the important evidence. Right, Polly? Yes, yes. Sort of. Huh? What's that? Thanks, Helly. What? I don't know. This means that it was spooky. Magic wand, where are you? Magic wand? Where's my magic wand? <laughs> Catch the thief! Catch the thief! Huh? <laughs> huh? <laughs> spooky? Huh? Oh my gosh, spooky? You're stealing my tires? Uh, Let's get spooky! Uh, no, I didn't do anything. Really, I'm not a thief. Everybody calm down. Uh -huh. Now tell me what's going on here. I'll tell you. We're catching the thief. I was tired of being called a robber. Me too. Oh, I'm sorry. I should have found this clue earlier. Ah, uh, it's my magic wand. Spooky, please tell me what's been going on. Stay back! Polly, huh? uh, before you get stuck to me, too. What? What are you talking about? I don't understand it. All I did was get struck by lightning. Then suddenly, I was like this. Lightning? When it got hit by lightning, and now it's magnetized. Ah, now I understand what's going on. Mr. Wheeler, the thief isn't spooky. It's lightning. What? what? Do you remember the thunderstorm we had last night? Spooky was struck by lightning last night and became a magnet. The tires stuck to him while he was passing the store. He didn't on? know he'd been get magnetized. Up, up. Spooky tried to get the tires off himself when Mr. Wheeler got to the store and spotted him. Stop! Thief! Mr. Wheeler's shouts startled poor confused Spooky and he drove away. And that's the solution to the mystery. Isn't it, Spooky? Is that the truth? Yes. I wanted to return the tires, but everyone in town was on a crazy robber hunt. Oh, poor Spooky. Uh, mm. By being so suspicious of everybody, I hurt so many of my friends. Me too. Sorry. Sorry. So we've learned that suspecting friends without evidence is not good. Well, the misunderstanding is all cleared up. Give me back my tires. I'd love to, but they're stuck to me and they aren't coming off. Oh, he's right. What are we going to do, Polly? Don't worry, everyone. We can solve the problem at the rescue center. Is this really going to work, Jin? Of course. 
When this machine absorbs the electricity from the lightning, your problem will be solved. Don't worry, Spooky. Trust me. Here we go. Huh? Ooh, they were getting so heavy. Wow. Hey, Jin, it's just like you said. Told ya. <laughs> Good for you, Spooky. Welcome back from Magnet World. Welcome back. Thanks a lot. The next time there's a thunderstorm, this car is staying inside. <laughs> <laughs> you see, there's no thief in Broomstown. I knew it all along. <laughs>